Hey guys, Justin here from Justin Tech, and I got today the Asus external hard drive. I needed one of these because I had a customer come to me and they wanted a, a hard drive reformat on a very old computer. Do you remember these? I, uh, I couldn't find a CD-ROM drive that worked with one of those, and theirs both had been burnt out. Well, not burnt out, the drive worked, but it no longer read disks. So I needed to find an external solution that came with the Asus external slim hard drive. Let's try to open this thing up. I haven't tested it yet on this computer, so we'll just see if it works. Hopefully it will do what I need it to. Okay, so when you pull it out, nicely packaged with foam, got your driver, got your quick installation guide, USB cable, pull this out. I think there's a stand in there as well somewhere. There should have been. Let's see how this works. Okay. So as you can see, very nice, very shiny. Quite slim as well. So your eject button there. USB 2.0 in the back. And I thought there was a stand for this one, you know? Let me check the guide. I could be wrong. Could have been for the previous generation. Stand is optional. But I don't think I have it included in the case. Is it supposed to come with it? You guys let me know. If you guys know better, you tell me. I'm going to try to hook this up though, to save time. Twist ties, I love twist ties. Alrighty, what is this? Why do we have two USB prongs? I'll have to look that up, I'm not familiar with that, but let's hook up the USB 2.0 in the back. I'm going to try hooking up to the computer with one prong first, see if that works. It's not very long cord, I wanted to keep this running in the display while I did it, but unfortunately the computer's down here. Hey guys, I'm back. Alright, I got this thing all set up. I brought the desktop up here so you guys could see this lovely piece of hardware. And what I'm going to try to do now is I'm going to install the drivers that came with it to test out the draw, uh, drive. <coughs> so let's pop it out, oh, just like that. Pop our disc in. Oh, you gotta go under the lip because it is built nice and compact. Sleek. Alright, see what happens. Cross your fingers. Let's hope this is going to fail. Oh, there we go. See, just like that, nice and quick. Just to give you some ideas of the speed, there is the, the reading speed on the top and the writing speed below. You can just pause the video if you want to see that. I believe it's in focus so you can see it. If not, I will tell you the reading speed of, I'm just going to use a DVD rewritable as an example. Uh, the reading speed is 8 times. For CD rewritable is 24 times. And VCD playbacks 10 times, audio CDs 10 times, and the writing speed for DVD rewritable is 8 times, CD rewritable is 16 times, CD, CDR is 24 times. This is uh, usable with 7, Vista, XP, pretty much all the operating systems, as well as Mac OS uh, X 10.5 or above. Um, you can see here on the back of the product, some people care to see this. Show that you can burn some of the features there. Cool. I really like the diamond cut plate on it that Asus uses. It looks very nice. For 35 bucks, you can't go wrong. It looks sick. It, uh, it performs well. It's very quick. It to do up apparently. And uh, I, I would give this a good review. I, I really enjoy this product. It worked well for what I needed it for. I mean, now I can uh, boot up and reformat as the uh, client needed, and it's good to have. I mean, it's always good to have. In case your drive fails, you always have that as a backup. So uh, thank you for visiting Justin Tech. Uh, be sure to tune in at jstn.ca, as well as on YouTube at uh, youtube.com slash jstntech, T-E-C-H, and Facebook as well, Justin Tech. 
Thank you.